Hi everyone, how are you all? Hope you are doing very well. So let's go ahead and continue our journey and do some uh, drop down here. When I click, let me show you the final version of the app. If I click here, it shows this. So this is very powerful and it's very handy when you want to make a drop down like this. So let's go ahead and show you the trick behind it. So we have this, okay. I will go to the nav bar, search bar, I am here and I have the image here, okay so first of all, let's take this image out and make component here, I will call this let's watch, okay, header, let's call this account drop down, okay and uh, let's call this okay view here at logo and skip all the view very quickly and let's put the image here and uh, so let's use this here now so what we have so let's make one one here and that's imported so it will be account drop down from current directory and this bad boy and let's register this here all right cool so cool stuff here so let's use it here okay cool so we have the image back here so let's make some space in the right where is it where is it yeah so this bad boy and let's make the class margin right one maybe uh, all right cool so we have some space so let's go ahead and design this lovely uh, rounded div with these three links in it so first of all we have the image here and the image this clearly will be a button okay and we will have a full div as well and we will control this using uh, is open all right so let's go ahead and do this all right so let's make this in a button okay uh, let's see what we have all right cool so we have this here so and let's define some data here and this will be function and what the function return is open okay false Alright, cool. So let's use uh, this. So what we're going to do is create a new div here. Okay. And let's uh, make some links inside. So we have account setting. So this will be account setting. Okay. And uh, let's make another one called. I have no idea what we, the other one is. So let's grab it here support and logouts cool cool all right so we have this lovely div here and doesn't do it much yeah so we have it here so let's make uh, some style and like let's make this white okay and let's make it from the right zero because I want it from the right and as well I want to make it absolute but before this let me make it rounded very quickly and this will be large like this all right so cool so let's make this absolute so we can align it anywhere we want so like this all right cool so it's here in the right but I'm not satisfied about this so let's make this class relate rela relative relative okay so let's see what we have all right so cool so this aligned to the his parent which is the uh, thingy the relative this one okay so this look for the first parent were relative and will align accordingly all right so we have the div here okay Alright, so we have the, our, our div here, but very small, so let's make some width of 48. And, alright, cool. So, 
it's I want to align it the right zero which is this the div okay how we can do this here right zero like this and it doesn't work we spell right wrong we have r i g h t all right cool so we have it here just to refresh the base and it works so all right so cool we can't see the link we have to make class text uh, gray maybe of 500 and we will see this bad boy all right cool so let's copy and paste this here and here and yes so let's do some class so let's make it first of all let's make this uh, bad boy block okay and uh, say so this will hold all the div hold from here to here and so let's make it as well we have a block and let's make some padding from the left and right for and some from the top and the bottom as well cool we are very close and let's make some shadow all right shadow x large maybe uh, all right so we have some sh shadow here and so let's see what we want to do and let's make it maybe yeah so this very nice but i want i want the shadow here for hold of not for this only all right so we have a lovely shadow here and finally let's make uh, some effect and hover there is effect for the background which always i use okay in g i g go and let's make it 500 maybe all right cool and so we have this like this and let's make so we have so i will put this a new line because we have i have extension reformat this so let's make this like this okay and let's make text of for example when hover i need to change the text to white like this so let's all right cool we have cool stuff here so let's grab this copy and paste it here and here as well. well let's see what we have cool so we have it here very nice all right very cool stuff here all right so let's go ahead and i'm not fancy about this because this hide the corner here so let's make some maybe bedding for f2 and see if this solves the issue yep so bingo and also i want to change the color to 500 here and here cool also i want to push this in the left so after we make it zero with the parent div okay what we want to make is margin right of or two three maybe yeah. cool cool stuff so we have it here now but this doesn't do much okay so let's hide this when i click here show it and hide it so where is the lovely button here and on the click simply we will call this is open okay and like this and this should do the trick so let's see so what we have yes yeah, so we have to hide and show this accordingly okay so we have the first false and this will be a true all right i forgot to assign it here so like this let's see still doesn't work because we have so let's see my like this maybe and still it doesn't show so we have the open let's make this grab this here Alright, so it doesn't work because we don't need to use this and uh and the dom here okay so all right cool and i don't like the way it was this blue in the in the button here so let's make some class here okay 
and let's make the class first of all maybe heading or oh, not heading all right so let's okay so let's make it uh, let's hide the border or let's make the border of two two see what we have all right cool so let's hide the focus focus outline if i remember outline and let's make it none okay and see if this work and this doesn't work so outline focus outline okay and let's make it white all right so let's uh, delete this border so we don't need it okay let's make like this okay and yes so let's go ahead now and if i click here okay but i'm i'm not happy about the outline so let's make the outline just only like uh, focus okay outline none all right cool so it's working so no uh, border so let's go ahead now and handle the scape all right so if i come here and make created all right and make like this and see what we have to do here let's uh, let's make the key event here handle the scape all right let's make conest and let's define handle scape equal to function like this and yes yeah, so let's here now grab uh, this thingy the key okay and very easy to do it's very easy we have done it so this scape or here the key equal to scape like this okay and this will uh, do something which is we know what we want to do is false here okay so very cool so i, I handle scape all right good so let's add to the whole document okay add event listener and this will be fire when the key down what we want to fire is uh, handle scape so let's check if this bad boy works so let's go ahead here all right cool so escape and it's working all right so let's do something else if i click here it doesn't uh, exit so let's make uh, this happen i will define here a button okay and i will give it some uh, classes and full will be full screen so let's see in action what i want to do we want to do a button okay and let's do class first of all i will make it fixed okay and we from the top all right here all right to the right zero whole will we'll take whole the scre uh, screen whole window cool so after we we have done this so let's make uh, bottom zero as well to the bottom and let's give it full width and full height and see what we have all right so yeah we we can see the button here so we can't uh, do anything with this okay and if i bg for it for example and make it 500 we will see the background cover whole the screen so we have a div, uh, button hold the screen all right so let's remove this and see what we have i will make it opacity all right opacity of 50 okay and i will give it uh, the to work the opacity we do it black color like this okay so and yeah so opacity here we 50 oh sorry 500 not 50 yeah. so we have this lovely uh, transparency all right cool and let's make so let's see cool so let's make that uh what we have to make now when you click here all right uh, it sh 
شو ذا باتن اورايت هايد هايد ذا ديستينجي ذا ديف ذا دروب داون اورايت وي دو ذس فيري ايزي باي هاندل لايك ذس فيو اف از اوبن اورايت اف ذس از اوبن يا فيو ذس باد بوي از وي كان سي هير اورايت ناو وين كليك هير اي ونت تو كلوز ذا ويندو سمبلي كليك از اوبن False. Let's see if this work. Let's hear. Cool. So it's working. Perfect. Yes. So yes. So it's very good here. Everything is perfect. Just one more thing, guys. I want to clear this when the component is finished, is destroyed. So we we can make hook here. So once I believe this, okay, and let's call hook. So I believe hook before this destroy. All right. So what I want to do here is to make function as we have done it before. So what is the function will be? So I will remove this. So let's make it. The command remove event event remove. Event listener and this will be handle escape like this. Cool. So this will fire when the blah 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 when destroy the the component hold the component. This will be destroyed. But to remove from where, which from the key down here. All right. Cool stuff. Cool. So we have this lovely trick here fixed and yeah. So everything is work perfect. So, and let's make the cursor as well of default. So we have the cursor outside. Yeah. So yes, you see, there is no pointer here. All right. Cool. So yeah. So it's very cool stuff. Very cool. So everything is work perfect. And yeah. So you have it, guys. Now. So we have our. Lovely menu here, and yeah, so that's it for this lesson. Hope you enjoy. I will push this to the repo, and you will find the in the description the link. And yes, if you like this video, please subscribe, like it, and yes, see you guys in the next video. Bye.